It's a common sight in Spokane that may be happening or in front of your home. People parking RVs in residential areas and living in them. Well, now city leaders are trying to figure out how to address concerns about crime and get those people into affordable and stable housing. KX by 4 is Ariana Lake working for you. She spoke with Councilwoman Kate Burke, who is leading this effort. Ariana? One of the big questions for the council is how to create a safe place for these RV dwellers to go to where they can connect with city resources to make their lives better. Spokane Municipal Code says you can't park a motor home on a street right of way in a residential zone for more than four continuous hours for active loading or unloading. And overnight parking between 9 p.m. and 7 a.m. is also illegal, but that's not stopping people. Other residents are noticing and they're getting concerned about it. That's why Councilwoman Burke wants to help connect these RV dwellers with resources. Well, I think it's uh, something we need to really start humanizing people's experiences and make sure that they know that we're listening to what they're going through and that we don't want to make their life harder. We want to help them get to housing, get to shelter. The council is still just starting to talk about this issue. One idea suggested today was getting passes for people to park in designated areas with water and sewer hookups, and then city resources can go to them to connect them with agencies to help them get back on their feet. Burke said she really wants to hear from you about possible solutions or any experiences you have dealing with this issue. We have info to get in touch with her on KXLY.com. Reporting live in studio, Ariana Lake, KXLY 4 News. Thank you, Ariana.